In this community, Chukunko, we found a girl by the name Blessing. Amazingly, Blessing is a cobbler. For those who don't know what a cobbler is, a cobbler is a shoemaker. Yes, and she is the final year student of University of Abuja. So having to go to school and get a skill is amazing to me. So I decided to take this stop so I get to talk to her and know how it has been for her. Let's go. My name is Blessing. I'm from Kogi State, a final year student of University of Abuja, the first child of my family. I chose to become a shoemaker because I was making beat. I normally get shoes and beat them. But I just decided that why beat them instead of producing them and beating them together. So I got to notice that there is fun in producing shoes, what you know that everybody puts on every day. So that was what motivated me to learn shoemaking and also to merge it with my bag productions. So aside from here, do you sell in school? Do you sell to friends and family? Yes, I sell to friends and family and I also sell online. How has it been for you being a cobbler, doing shoemaking, yeah. having to use the hammer? You were supposed to do makeup, all those kind of things, but you started shoemaking. So how, do, how is it for you? It's fun. fun. It's fun. Do I have to, sometimes I hit my hand or when I'm filing, I get to burn myself, but it's fun. Okay. Yes, because it's my hobby. I like producing and thinking of new, new styles to produce, yes. Okay. So in the last one month, how many shoes have you produced? Over 10. Um, in the next five years, by God's grace, I want to have a brand name. Yes, a name that will be as famous as Gucci and other, yes, and other wears like Fenji. I want my brand name also to be famous. That is it. How is this business selling in a community like this? No, it doesn't really base here. It doesn't really base here. Because once you have your phone, you can go very far. So yes, whenever I produce, I just take their pictures and post them, tag any other person I can tag, even Instagram. I just, because with phone, wherever you are, you just go far. Somebody taught Blessing how to make shoes, and I will be interviewing that person. My name is Clement. Clement. Yeah. Okay, so tell me, um, as Blessing Waka called me to say she won't learn shoemaking, why you allow, why you choose to teach women shoemaking? Why you know say, you know, be woman kind of job, but you allow, you agree to teach her why? Uh, you know, say at times she always come around to buy from me, go and sell. So this time she can't talk. Say you get one seminar. Where they've been do for where she made a stay, two week seminar. But if she can't get more interest for the work. So she can't remember, say, she get somebody where they give her shoes, where they go sell. When she come around, she gonna tell me, say, she won't learn how to make shoes. I said to know her, Alan. When she tell me, say, she didn't make bag, that's okay. It's okay for she to join the bag and the shoe together. Uh, so she says she would like get brand in the next five years, brand name. So you see, say with her zeal and the attention she put for the job, now what is she going to achieve? It's up to her. In the next five years, she feel make them. That's the, the thing, I just say, make she put seriousness and make she pray about her. Uh, in the next five years, eh, she can she feel get name, get her own brand. Yeah. Okay, so how should business they sell for this Chukunku community? Did they move, the market they move or? Uh, for the past two months, the thing did they move. For now, man, all like you, the thing don't hook up. I got around tired up. They tell the whole truth. Oh. Now to even see food trauma is a problem, but I just go. Abuja Rokai is produced by Justice Crack Production.